What's going on, YouTube? I'm coming in and bringing you another ro retro cartoon drawing. As I promised, this is Sable Riders and the Star Sheriff. Um, I haven't really seen this cartoon in a long time, so I, I really don't remember the backstory. So I'm right now. I'm just trying to remember some of the stuff that basically this cartoon was bit um was based off of a original anime that was named I got I think it was the Star Musketeer from Bismarck or the Star Musketeer Bismarck which is basically the black one. Um this was a old 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 cartoon. This used to come on this was like it wasn't one of my favorite cartoons. It was a a fill-in cartoon between Brave Star and a couple other ones. The Galaxy Rangers and Brave Star. I think it was Cowboy and Moo Mesa. And I think it was Sailor Moon. I think it used to come on, uh, if I'm not mistaken, it used to come on Toonami. Back in the day, where Cartoon Network had uh, Toonami before they only have, I think it was, um, Cart... I forgot what the hell they call a after after dark special now on um Cartoon Network. Cartoon Network is not the same as it used to be to me. Like it's just me because I grew up on Cartoon Network. I remember what Cartoon Network had Justice League. They had some cartoons on there, but then they got these dumbass cartoons that I just can't get into. Only new cartoon that they have that I can get into is Adventure Time. But back to this, this was an anime. I think it was one of the first couple animes that was um like widely released in America. Like that would like play on Cartoon Regular. It came out around the same time Dragon Ball Z. Believe it or not, Dragon Ball Z been around from the early '80s, to be honest. And hi, we're Haibu, and we so it's like businesses take off in the digital space. So with us. So it's like crazy that I had an early, like, I had an early influence, not influence, but I had an early encounter with anime, and I did not know it. I did not know Sailor Moon was an anime, Dragon Ball Z. I knew nothing about animes when I was younger. Um, what else was anime that I did not <laughs> realize? That's a pretty, pretty fair amount of cartoons that I did not know was anime when I was younger. Um, some people will try to say TMNT was, but TMNT was not an anime. It was drawn and published by two college students that is making money to this day because TMNT will never die. It keep be revamped, is revamped and it's going to live out his legacy. I'm, I know they did have an anime at one point. They changed, turned it into an anime. I think it was a uh, Go Ninja Turtle something. It was like, it was ridiculous. I had it toy, but it was ridiculous. Now that I watch it. But, um, yeah, I had a, uh, um, the Super Mario show. <laughs> Super Mario, man, I, I tell you, I was like, when you were younger, you're you're really dumb to the stuff that you're watching until you get older and then you watch him like, yo, that's considered the anime. Like, I would never had figured that Pokemon. Well, Pokemon kind of figured it was an anime because I had the early release of Red and Green. I had the Japanese versions. So I didn't have Pokemon Red and Blue until they actually came out. So. They sold those type of copies in one of the, in them, the mom and pop stores that got stuff that you're really not supposed to have in America yet. But hey, what are you gonna do? Um, I'm getting all cracked because I really don't remember this cartoon like that. It was a request on um, Instagram to draw Sable Riders. I actually have to go back and watch this cartoon to remember actually I should have did it before I even recorded this video but I want to keep showing out the content for you since I'm back off my break I will be taking a week break every month from now on so to keep my shoulder 
and wrist cool so this is Sable Riders if you enjoyed the video like comment subscribe share this with your friends name a retro cartoon that you want to see drawn peace